<sighs> Alright, welcome back. We're continuing the a series of me trying new weapons. And pretty much the last, well, last new weapon we did was the Undercover Umbrella. And goodness gracious, that was terrible. <laughs> I still stand by, I still stand by what I say. If you use that weapon, you're either trolling or you're messed up in the head. <laughs> but, we're about to, about to jump into a new weapon. So let's go and find the next weapon we're going to use. Alright. Pretty much let's check the weapon weapons we have here. Now this is within fresh season, so this site hasn't hasn't updated the new kits yet. But since it's just new kits and I don't think there's gonna be any new weapons going forward, we can we can still use we can still use this site as it is right now. Oh since my since I said I'll be trying the I'll be trying the weapon itself and the kits added on. So whatever I pick, I will pay I will be playing that weapon and the and the kits and the new kits that go along with it. So yep, remove this. So remove this, this piece of <laughs> of a weapon, and let's see what weapon we're gonna be using today. I hope I can perform well with this weapon, because playing against it, it's so hard. <laughs> I'm, there are a lot of times where I'm actually kind of scared using this, <laughs> going up against it, because so, just because I know how good how good it is. But all right. Let me find the, let me find the right gear for this, and we'll get started. Okay, realize I didn't really need to change much. <laughs> I'm just simply gonna say, yeah, you can already see the my freshness meter. <laughs> it's already up there. I did meddle with this like a long while ago, oh, but well, it just it just wasn't my thing at the time. I'm so and so like I had like a rough a rough first me first first experience with it. It's like just like it was just like meddling around with it. Well, let's. Let's let's form a concrete opinion on this weapon. So remember, two turf wars, three anarchy, three anarchy, anarchy battles. Let's get started. Uh, seeing what Stamper is like nowadays, I don't think I can recreate what they what they. Need. What those players do. I don't think I could just I don't think I could recreate that. So hopefully I can Hopefully I can do something good with this. Oh don't do it. Yes. Oh my god. Got a single kill in on this. Oh, finally a kill. Okay. <laughs> okay, much better. <laughs> much better around that final minute. That should be a win. Yeah, that's a win. As I as I figured, it's, it's it works so well. As I'm pretty much using this, I'm I'm just <laughs> what's going through my head right now is I'm thinking like, what can I show that everyone on that some that other that other people just haven't already shown. I I mean I can I can I don't know if I can have have much more. It's <laughs> this is a good weapon. This is such a good weapon. That's such a good two-piece combo. <laughs> that is so good. Bruh. 
That's an example right there. That's an example right there. That just shows I'm a noob at this. <laughs> can't even time my can't even time my full charge charge correctly. It's hard. At least it's hard for me to it's hard for me to understand how to how to use the weapon. I'm pretty much thinking like how can I use that use the burst bomb well? And I guess the main thing is just how do I <laughs> how do I properly use the zip caster? I mean heck I use a Sasha deck and I still have trouble understanding the zip caster. <sighs> Alright. Let's get this let's get three get those three anarchy battles in. Man, I love this. And I love that two, love that two-way combo. It's so, it's so good. Hmm. Hmm. That's. I don't know if this. I don't know if there'll be any help, help for. I don't even know if there'll be any help, help for it. But I'm wondering, would there be any benefit to do like a left-handed swing? It'd be crazy if there wasn't. If someone could find an advantage for that. Sucks because I just don't know what to, I don't I don't know what to look for. That's hard. have to know I have to know when I want to do a full charge into a, into a small hit and and then I need to know when is the right moment to just go in for the for the one hit kill clearly I don't know it yet I don't know the, I don't know the situations yet I mean, if anything I hope I hope I can find it within these next two matches you know what speaking further on like I said like I said earlier with the this left on the, the fact that you could do a left-handed speaking further on that I don't know if this will I don't know if this would make a huge impact on things, but I feel like I should ask. Would it make a difference in if you were able to make your make your inkling either right-handed or left-handed? I'm wondering how much of a difference would that make? Because in my opinion, I feel like that would make a, a huge difference. Moment like that where I, that was a moment like that where I feel like 
I mean, yeah, I could have killed faster. Just gotta learn to be precise with it. Fifty-two. Yeah. <laughs> uh. Hmm. Okay. Okay. I'm getting a lot more kills now. <laughs> How much does a how much does a 52 gal? Well, I know I know a stamper out range is it, but how much though? Still plus my two two. Do they still think that? <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> oh no, that's so funny. Okay, that was that was much more productive. 15, 15 and nine. That is way more productive. <laughs> ah, <laughs> timing of it all. Ooh, clamblets. Probably, yeah, it's I'm, okay. It's, I don't know, it might be because I'm personally left handed. Why do I get <laughs> I feel like I, I feel like I have much more comfort in, in this by swinging a left handed, left handed full charge. <laughs> I, I gotta say, if the devs just wish, I mean, if they could just, I doubt they ever will, but well, uh, uh, it would be nice if you if you could give the ingling just. Like the opportunity to do stuff left handed. Hmm. This doesn't this doesn't help though. This doesn't help the fact that this is my first time playing Clan Blitz with a stamper. <laughs> this is this is just not helping at all.
Oh my, I still scored! Thank you, team. Can't score clam, though. I just gotta say, I'm just straight up jealous. I'm straight up jealous just, just when I see um, stamper players here do what they do. Such a quick kill time. It's nuts. And I'm dead. You homie. <laughs> oh man. Ten to eight. Not bad. Well, I mean I mean what I mean what <laughs> again, like what more could I say about this weapon? Like, it's such a good weapon. Like, it covers long range. You can if you can get up close, close if you're for a one hit kill. It's like you have burst and you have burst bomb, so it's a nice so it's you already have a good sub weapon added on top of uh, of a great of great attacking. Hacking from the main weapon itself. And and I mean I'm not a good zip cat I'm not a good zip caster player. <laughs> I'm not good with it. But I de but I but I definitely know the know the potential is there. I already, I definitely know how good it is. So I mean, I mean, my, what more is there to say? It has a great blend of, of long range and melee hey, hey, attacking. Although I although this although it would bring up the question, what other what alternate kit would you add to this? If I had to give one suggestion, <laughs> give give this weapon the Kraken. I don't. You know what? I don't. Know, I don't this is a weird. This is a weird combination. I don't know, and I don't, I don't know. You can let me know if it's if it's like, if it's a good combination or not. I feel that this one this would work well with a point sensor and a kraken, cause cause because because pretty much if you use a if you can use a point sensor and you can use all your long all your long range to poke it is to poke at the enemy and pretty and pretty much kraken would just give it would just give the weapon another and another great tool a tool for for. For killing the and the opponent. I don't know. This is my this is my opinion. This is my feel. <laughs> but if you do have a your own idea idea about what would work for this what would work for this weapon, leave a leave a comment. Let me know about it. <laughs> so pretty much my final final judgment on this weapon. It's obviously a great weapon. I pretty much, I pretty much said that within the first ten, first ten seconds. Like it's a great weapon. So yeah, that'll be that's it for this episode. Leave a like, leave a like, subscribe, leave a comment, and all that. I'll see you in the next episode where we try a new weapon. 
See ya.